Upon reaching the Antarctic, the differences in preparation began to show. Scott's team struggled with the harsh conditions almost from the start. The motor sledges proved unreliable in the extreme cold, and the ponies were not suited to the icy terrain, suffering greatly and slowing the expedition's progress. The reliance on technology, which seemed a strength, quickly became a liability. The team was forced to resort to man-hauling their heavy equipment, draining their energy and morale. Amundsen's journey, meanwhile, was a model of polar efficiency. The sled dogs thrived in the cold, allowing the team to move quickly and set up supply depots along the route. These caches, strategically placed during the journey to the pole, ensured that the return trip would be just as swift. On December 14, 1911, Amundsen and his men reached the South Pole, 